Hello everybody. I hope everybody's having a great day today. Please be sure to subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell. Now quick aside, if you hear banging or chainsaws, that's hubby working hard on my house. So that's that's a good thing. <laughs> that's a, that's We want that. <laughs> but I do apologize for the noise if it comes up. Uh, and in the video, it only comes up like the f last five minutes of the video. So don't worry about that. Now, for all of you who don't know who I am, my name is Bridget. I'm a 54-year-old woman who rediscovered makeup properly recently. Used to do make I did makeup my makeup for 30 years, but I had like six things of makeup: a concealer, a, a foundation, mascara, and and one quad. I stay louder. That that's it. That's that's pretty much what I had. I had no clue. I just... And I'm having fun now. I'm having a lot of fun. And makeup has become my therapy. And I'm feeling better. I'm actually doing some working out a little bit, just a little bit. And that I hate to say it, but I don't hate to say it at the same time. A lot of people are going to go, yeah, right. It is because of makeup. Because makeup makes me happy. Anything that makes you happy will have the same impact. If it's not makeup, but it's playing video games, there you go. Just don't play eight hours straight, that's all. <laughs> so let's get going into this look. Yeah, okay, so I thought I'd get a head start and get my chemistry going before uh, starting the video, and I'm hoping this is a better color than last time. So we shall see. I think it is. I think it very much is. I think I'm going to get it right, because last time I put way too much of the Pericone, which is the darker color. It would seem that the internets more and more uh, people doing videos on YouTube are of the mindset use what you have and I love that I absolutely love that because I even responded to one uh, lady on her video and uh, said I've seen influencers with gobs and gobs and gobs and gobs and gobs of makeup and there's no way one person can use all that it's just impossible not even in one lifetime and some of them will do a clean out when the products are still viable and some of them will just hold on to products like these are my babies I understand that there's a lot of stuff that I would hold on to but when you have enough products for a hundred people to last a lifetime it's time to let some stuff go and then when they do let it go it's all garbage because it's all expired and that is sad it is really really sad because there are so many people out there that can use these products and makeup makes a difference i'm i'm an example of that because depression just grabs hold of you and for you to just try and let it go is beyond impossible unless you have help or the will to do it and I've been in depression mode before 
for certain reasons and I've managed to pull myself out and then again for other reasons and pulled myself out and now I'm in depression mode because I can't do anything I can't work I'm not bringing in any money my poor husband is his body is falling apart because he's working too hard too long a lot of guilt and Catholic guilt is our middle name <laughs> but makeup is my therapy plus a couple of a, a few good people on the internet who oh I'm gonna cry again there's a few people on the internet who are so good to me that they are better than any therapist could ever be. I, I can't put on my... Good criminy! I can't even put on my concealer because my eyes are watering right now. So, makeup makes a difference. And there are places that will take it in and help the women that need it the most and when I see influencers with huge walls of makeup that just sits there because they're using the same products over and over again be right back okay sorry about that but even though you never noticed the difference <laughs> It was good for me. My hubby came back because he's helping our neighbor with one of his properties. So, yeah, going back to the wastage, um, there are a lot of people. Makeup is my therapy. Makeup, I notice it if I don't do my makeup five days at least in a week. If I don't do my makeup five days in a week, I'm... I'm, I'm down and the big D is going to grab hold of me again. The big D is there, but we're fighting and I want to win this fight. So if you don't use it, share it. That's what I do. One of my girls has a lot of friends in her cosplay world. She just came on Thursday. I gave her a bag of stuff. All of my declutters a day. All of those. I've, I hadn't done it and she's telling me she's coming and I'm scrambling to fill them and all that again. Every time she comes over she's got a bag of makeup and she shares it amongst everybody. And that's the way it should be. Because makeup, as far as I'm concerned, helps you feel better. Because women, men yes as well, but women for sure. Our self-esteem is linked to how we perceive ourselves. And Makeup helps us perceive ourselves as more beautiful. <laughs> so we need to share what we have extra. And that's what I do. And I hope everybody else does. And it pisses me off to no end when I see bags and bags and bags and bags tens of thousands of dollars of makeup that has to go in the garbage when it could have helped at least a hundred women. If I knew how to set up uh, something like that, 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 that I can't even remember the name of it, for, for women to come and get makeup, low-income women, women who've been abused, women, the whole gamut. If I knew how to set that up and get donations and pass them on, I would do it.
I really would. I just it wouldn't. I don't. I just don't even know where to start. I don't think we have one of those in Ottawa, but I don't even know where to start. Oh well. Okay. The other thing. Speaking about using what you have. Last year when I put in my order for Shop Miss A, I got this lip scrub. It's rose scented. They had other scents. If you don't like rose, they had other scents, but I love rose. <laughs> and I try to put it on my lips before I do my makeup. Half the time it works. <laughs> it's half the time I remember. My lips right now, it, it's got the beads. The scrubby beads are bigger than you would find in in a good brand. <laughs> but those are expensive. Like, seriously, for a little pot, you, you're lucky to get it for $15? <laughs> I'd love that, but... There's other makeup that I find I need more than a lip scrub. Okay. Now that I've spoken with my husband and had a bit of a laugh, and if you hear anything, he's in the shower. Uh, my eyes are not watery anymore. <laughs> that helped. <laughs> so let's go. I don't know if I'll ever finish this. I do know that if I get another Rare Beauty, well, if, when I get another Rare Beauty <laughs> concealer, I will need to get at least the next uh, color up. This is 180W. I'm going to have to check the uh, Sephora website to find out what color is up from that one. We shall see. So right now it's concealer time. I don't know how this happened but this concealer from Rare Beauty is the number one for my crinkles because it literally pulls them apart. It, I, can't, I can't believe it. I really can't believe it. See, I got this after I did my test of all my um, concealers. So unfortunately, it's not in that video, but what can you do? Okay, I watched a video with, I can't think of names right now. I can't think of her name. Jen Phelps, yesterday. And she was doing dupes. And there was only one that I had from her video and others that I have in a cart. <laughs> but the one that I have there you go that one and it is in light and she says in well in her opinion and her, she's an expert that's what she does that's what her video her channel is all about is about comparisons and she says that this is pretty much the exact same as the Chanel I mean granted I would love to have the Chanel <laughs> I really would it also is in a cart so even though right now I'm supposed to be testing out powders everything powders. I am um, taking a break and just using what I have.
Okay, so it would seem that, as, as I was thinking, that these two have found their way into my project pan because they are old. They're still okay. I'm not having any issues. I just need to use them, but it's going to take a while because it's literally two bottles. So they found their way into my project pan inadvertently. <laughs> and I've got this in it as well because hot, hot days. I want to use that up as well because I've got a lot and I don't want to waste it. I want, That's why I love doing the project pan because it's all about using it all. And speaking of project pan, this was in my project pan last year. Look how far I got. It's beautiful. It is absolutely gorgeous and I need to finish it because it's getting there in age. So today It is back in my project pan. I haven't done an update on my project pan in ages, but I use it daily. I have not used a whole lot of the Kosas brand and I've n I have another cream blush but that's more berry so definitely more of a winter color um, but we don't hear a lot of this spoken about from Kosas we hear about the face powder and the bronzer but not a lot about their blushes. I don't know why. Oh, and of course their highlight, their uh, concealer and um, what's it called? Foundation. Everybody loves those. I'd love to try them. See, I don't know if I should powder, that's the thing. That's why I'm lost. Okay, you know what? We're going straight to the eyes. And we're using my hip dot. Ah, I wish it was the uh, Girl Scouts, but it's okay. All right, now. I'm wearing black and pewter. I have no idea. <laughs> I'm stumped. I am stumped. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Almost forgot again. Even though it's right in front of me. I want to use this up because I want to start using the ginger. Okay, I'm going to start, I might only do two colors. I really might just do two colors. So I'm going to start with Unknown, which is that one. I did love that palette that I had, but it only had like three shimmers or maybe four in a 15 pan. No, it needs to be, how many here? One, two, three, four. One, two, three, wait a minute. Yeah, there's four shimmers in a nine pan palette. So that that's kind of the ratio, you know? <laughs>
Okay. Yeah, that was fun. I I just I I'm too crinkly. Whoops. I'm too crinkly. I am way too crinkly. I'm just one big crinkle. But this is nice. I mean, everything blended beautifully and it looks I find that the some eyeshadows, and I need to make a list of this, and this is on me because I have no memory, but I am starting to find that there are some shadows that just relax my crinkles so that every time I've gone to wash my face, it doesn't look like I have any crinkles on my eyelids and whatnot. So I need to make a list of which shadows do that, and I think think this is going to be one of them. Just the way my crinkles are looking right now, I think they're just going to relax and just be beautiful. I am hoping, I am hoping, I am hoping. Okay. Um, yeah, I love that palette. Oh, wow. I am so happy I got it. Hip Dot is really good. Just make sure that you've got a good ratio of shimmers to your mats. <laughs> um, I don't think I'm going to do the powder. But, yeah, if you hear anything, it's hubby doing stuff around the house. He bought a whole lot of siding so that we can redo the siding on the house because the siding on the house is ick. <laughs> With lots of holes in it. Just because you live in a mobile home doesn't mean it has to look like a train wreck. I mean, it's we're not renting. We own this home. And we take pride in our home. And if you go to some videos, I'm sure you can find how our home looks. I've done a video in the kitchen, a video in the living room. You guys have seen the closet my husband have has created for me. Because that bedroom, that master bedroom, was just one long bowling alley and uh, as soon as we've got the money the laundry room is going to become an ensuite my hubby loves me <laughs> I am very fortunate to have him but as I keep babbling on I am going to keep babbling on while I do this and I shall return I'm back looking gorgeous and I thought I had a lull in the noise making. Sounds like my husband is trying to take this, this side deck off. <laughs> so I'm going to try to finish this quickly. It's just my lips. So I've got two Yensas, one lipstick, and I'm assuming this is lip gloss. And I've got the Rowan. I do also have the Illamasqua Clear, but I'm not, I don't think I'm going to wear that yet. I, I need to get some some good uh, lip liners. I have very few lip liners and they're not that great. I've got my Pillow Talk, which is good, but I want one or two more Charlotte Tilbury and it looks like I want one or two more Natasha Denona, which is what I'm wearing. No, I'm not high maintenance at all. <laughs> Not, not at all. <laughs> okay, Rowan, I don't think I'm going to do that. I'm... Oh, this is lip oil. Okay, I gotta hurry it up for you guys because you're going to hear a lot of chainsaws and whatnot. So let's try the Yensa. Yes, this is dark no let's not try the insect because look at how dark it is that's a winter color okay let's do the lip oil no oh. <laughs> i was wondering if i was gonna have to call him to help me oh i never did swatches i'm a so and so okay i'm gonna put on my lip oil and then i'm gonna do swatches for you quickly look at that don't you like listening to a chainsaw? It's so much fun. And yes, I did put... Uh, this one. 
Ashne Tash the Nona. Oh, yeah, it's quite peachy. It is very peachy. I prefer the mauves, like the, the, the color of the lip liner that I have from Natasha Danona. That's bang on. That that's that's my love. That is my absolute love. Okay, let's see. That's annoying. Okay. Two, three, and four. Let's see where I can do this. One two, three, and four. There we go. That's a hard working hubby for you. There we go. Those are so beautiful. And I used this one and I don't even remember. This one, I think. I used one of them <laughs> and now I'm doing the mats okay one two three four and five there we go I, I got the placement I got the placement all I had to do was put it I got the placement got the placement <laughs> I used these two. Oh, I love this palette. I really, really love this palette. What's it called? I have no idea what it's called. Hold on a sec. I didn't even do my hair. Uh, Witchy Warms. Witchy Warms. It's absolutely gorgeous. Love it. If you can get it, by all means, I got it on BoxyCharm. So, <laughs> but look at that. It's absolutely gorgeous. And then I got this right. Ah, ah, ah. I'm so proud of myself. And it gave me a chance to feel the lip oil. Whoops, that's wrong. Yensa. <laughs> and it's not on my teeth. <laughs> and it feels nice. I just wish it was mauve instead of peach. But what can you do? That's the only color they have. Thank you, everybody, once again for coming to visit with me. Please leave me a comment, like my video, and subscribe to my channel. A bientôt.